The last time I came was raining a lot. Welcome to the motocross designations at Fox Hills. The most atrocious conditions you've ever seen. I think it was a 98 or something like that. Staying upright, so that's all fun. <laughs> Riding here, 89 Yam, 125. Yeah, it's the bike I had when I was 15, so that's what, uh, that's what got me back into it. I've got me, got me uh, choosing one of those and, yeah, bring back memories. Yeah, so we're here at uh, Fox Hill um, once again for, for the second year of the VET MXON. You know, man, it's, it's, it's amazing to see from, you know, literally 12 months ago, it was, it was the very first time we had done this. Um, that Doc Wobbs and Dave, Dave King had put this race on. You know, we're back here for year two and it's like it's doubled in size and... There's nothing like it in the world, right? It's just uh, one of a kind. Um, and when I got the invite to come last year to the VMXDN, it was a pretty mellow race. This year it's taken on a little bit of a new face with a little bit more serious, a little bit more um, tuned up, I would say. It's a very special event. It's a big show. Completely different than uh, normally the races I have to attend. Uh, I think this is for uh, all of us uh, very noticeable and then we all enjoy the event. It's really an inclusive event. It's, uh, it's quite strange and I'm not quite sure what the magic formula is that gets people here because there are more people here by an exponential amount to watch older riders racing older bikes than there is to watch you know, the British Championship. We've got the sunshine and we are in for a big, big weekend here at what is going to be the biggest motocross event in Europe for sure. This year Yamaha are celebrating 50 years and in celebration of that they've launched a brand new livery for the current YZ and YZF ranges. So here it is ladies and gentlemen for the first time the brand new YZ250F in the anniversary colours. We've launched the 2024 um, YZ250F here in the 50 year anniversary livery and having Alessio Chiodi here riding a 93 YZ250, same bike as I'm riding but for some reason, there must be a technical reason, this bike's going about 25 seconds a lap faster around the track. Yeah, they, they, they started uh, two months ago to prepare that bike. That uh, I'm so, so, so happy and uh, so surprised uh, to, to make a good love with that bike because it's a little bit old, but uh, the feeling, uh, I, I not believe, but uh, it's a really, really good feeling. And then we had to modify a lot the bike to be, <clears throat> to be in a condition to race. We put some factory part, but mainly it's a production machine. So Kiko is riding well, it's a good rider, and then we really hope to achieve another better result. There is Evo class up to 89, my bike's up to 96 for class, and then the Super Ultra Evo is 2006. But the bikes have been ridden by these top lads as fast as they were back in the day, if not better, because obviously technology's moved on. And You know, the way we, we currently ride them compared to what they got rode back in the day and the jumps we're jumping today versus, you know, what they jumped back in the day. So uh, just all around, it's just a, an amazing event. It's, it's, it's massive. I mean, I don't know why it's massive. Like, I didn't, you know, in America, vintage racing's not even that big, but here it just, there's so many cool bikes with period correct stuff and just like all the right things for what they have, you know, it's, it's massive. I think everybody remembers the GPs here when it was the shared 250, 125 GP at Fox Hills with, you know, with of course Alessio and... Right hand corner, they go into the right hand and together, Fusar is there, Chiodi is there, Federici will certainly be there, Camelingo on the inside on the left of the screen at the Chiodi on the Yamaha, 
Yamaha's have been incredibly strong. The Italians have been one, two, and three. He has made his move. Chioli goes to the front yet again. That kind of the flavour and the feel of that kind of event in this natural amphitheatre of Fox Hills uh, just seems to attract the, uh, the imagination of people and. It's almost like a festival. You can hear the fans in the background now, and it's it's you know it's it's really cool to see. It's it is grassroots um, to its fullest, and everybody's racing two strokes. I mean, there's not a four stroke out there, you know. So it's it's really cool to see. Yeah, I feel uh, really good. So happy for the weekend, happy for Yama, happy for the UK public, and uh, happy for everything. And uh, so happy to to come uh, after uh, 25 years. And uh, so that is uh, the, the the best weekend I think for everybody. So so happy. Thank you very much.